Good morning, everyone. My name is Tammy Sadler-Jones. I'm the city administrator, and I'd like to call to order the License and Variance Board meeting for Wednesday, July 11th, 2018, at 10 o'clock a.m. Board members present to my left is Roy Acre, the fire chief, and to his left is Eric Randall, the city engineer. Elsa Thompson is taking the official meeting minutes. First item is a public hearing, variance request V18051 allow reduction of front setback from 23 feet to 15 feet for the construction of an addition to a single family residence, land lot 5250.40 acres, 3446 Lee Street, Molly Capistrant is the applicant. Can you step to the podium, please? And for the record, can you state your name? Yeah, my name is Molly Capistrant. Okay, and um, can you tell us about your variance request, please? Yes, um, we are adding a master suite addition onto the back of our house, and um, we're doing it on the back side, so it's a it's a corner lot. Mm -hmm. so that's what we're wanting to step back for. Okay. Any questions for the applicant? All right, and at this time we'll have Joey Stobbs from Community Development make comments, please. Joey Stobbs, Planner 2 with Community Development. Applicants requesting a variance at 3446 Lee Street to reduce the setback along Danielle or Daniel from 23 feet to 15 feet. Is it Danielle or Daniel? Daniel. Daniel. <laughs> <laughs> We're trying to figure that out. But, um, this is a corner lot and the addition will be at the back of the house following the same uh, building line as the existing house, but since the house sits at an angle to Lee Street, the further back along Daniel uh, it goes, the more the, the building encroaches that side setback or front setback along um, Daniel. So. We've uh, analyzed the request, recommended approval, haven't heard any issues or complaints from adjacent properties. And we just have one condition, a pretty standard condition that approval of the requested variant shall be conditioned upon the development of the property in substantial compliance with the site plan submitted with variance application. Any questions for the staff? Just one for clarification, Mr. Stobbs. So, so you, both the applicant and yourself described this as being on the back or the side of the house, and, we, and we've seen the the aerial. But the request variance is for front setback. Is that's is, that's because it's on a corner? Yes, sir. Tree, so it's still so they this house technically has two front setbacks, right? Correct. Okay. Thank you. And I have a brief question. Um, this is R15 zoning. Uh, what does this addition do to the percent impervious cover on the project, on the site? Does, is it below the 35% threshold? It's definitely below the 35%. Okay. It's like a larger lot, right? Yeah. Okay. For the applicant, do you <coughs> accept the one condition as stated? Yes, I do. Okay. This is a public hearing. If anyone would like to speak regarding this issue, I ask that you please step to the podium at this time. And if the clerk can make a note that there's no one here but the applicant and staff. I'd like to entertain a motion, please. A motion to approve variance request V18-051 to allow the reduction of front setback from 25 to 15 feet for the construction of an addition to a single family <coughs> resident land lot 525, 0.40 acres located at 3446 Lee Street for Molly Capstrand as the applicant to include the one condition as read, read onto the record by staff. I second the motion. It's been motioned and properly second that we approve variance request V18051. All in favor, please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Thank you so much. Next item is a uh, Approval of the June 27, 2018 License and Variance Board meeting minutes. I make a motion to approve the 
June 27, 2018, License and Variance Board meeting minutes. Second. It's been motioned and probably second that we approve the June 27, 2018, License and Variance Board meeting minutes. All in favor, please vote. Motion passes unanimously. I'd like to declare this meeting adjourned at 10.05 a.m. Thank you.